So I honestly did not expect the first part of this series to do as well as it did. I always like to give it a few hours to kind of see. Uh, since views and stuff don't update, I just kind of go off the likes. And you guys absolutely crushed it so far. So here we go, about to do the second mission, uh, Atlas. I'm going to try to do a video per mission. I'm not sure if that's going to work, though. I don't know. It, as long as they're about the same length as that first mission, we should be fine. Uh, but with that being said, much love to all of you. If you want multiple parts a day, just keep doing what you're doing. And let's do this. After a second day of heavy fighting, U.S. Marines were successfully able to drive North Korean forces out of Seoul. With an additional division arriving soon, hopes are high that we may finally see a return to peace and stability in the region. Why is one man spared while another taken? To this day, I couldn't give you an answer. But death comes for us all, eventually. When you lose over 6,000 men in four hours, it's easy for one death to become just another number. But all I knew was my best friend was gone, and that part of me wished I had been taken instead. The dead, when they've settled their debts, it's up to the living to pick up the tab. And so it is time to say farewell to Private William Robert Irons, a man I had the privilege and honor to have under my command. A life is only important in proportion to its impact on the lives of others. By this standard, Private Irons ranks among one of our very best. He leaves behind family, friends, fellow Marines, and a grateful nation. It's Kevin Spacey. Old square to pay respects. So basically we're honoring the guy that got his hand st or the arm stuck in the helicopter. Or I'm going to say the helicopter. It's like the uh, drone type ship or whatever that was. I'm sorry, Mitchell. Will was one of our best. Look, we take care of our own. If you ever need Excuse me, Private Mitchell. I'm Jonathan Irons. I'm Will's father. Mr. Irons, I'm sorry for your loss, sir. I'm sure you are, Sergeant. Private Mitchell, you were Will's best friend. You both paid too high a price for your country. It was an unfortunate tragedy, sir. It was more than unfortunate, Sergeant. It was unnecessary. Son, I want to offer you a second chance. Mr. Irons, Mitchell's been discharged with his injuries. I'm aware of his injuries, Sergeant. At Atlas, we have prosthetics that are 20 years beyond anything the military could offer you. Will told me what kind of soldier you were. You deserve to fight for a military that's as effective as you are. Think about it. Don't let Will's death be in vain. Sergeant. Man, that transition was amazing. The thunder actually kind of scared me a little bit. Two on the terrace. Check that. Three. Oh, that's pretty neat. On you, Mitchell. Drop him. Set up so calm, U.S. Navy SEALs in this bitch. Where it all started for me on uh, online gaming, actually. Close on the kitchen. Every time I see Kevin Spacey, a lot of people might think of House of Cards, but I cannot help but think about the uh, Usual Suspects. It's one of my like my all-time favorite movies. Atlas Zero One, we are tracking POTUS. Media room, South Wing. 
Copy, Prophet. We're internal. All right, here we go, guys. Shoot through the whole thing, alright. My sensitivity is so fast, but when I aim in, it just slows down so much. Look at this business. Stack up at the door. They would rock that curved TV. You know what I'm talking about? Oh really? I thought I thought it just knocked out that one part of the screen. I'd be be like, that's uh it's a little uh ridiculous. We'll do this quiet. Get that mute charge ready. Oh, we kicked that guy. I was about to. I didn't want to melee the guy because I don't know how Roll close clear. he was to him. Mr. President, we're an Atlas rescue force. Can you authenticate? Zulu Tango. Okay, please keep your head down and stay close. All right, son. Prophet, we have the package. Moving to extract. Copy Atlas Zero One. Egress to the North Access Road. Copy that. Get him out of here. This way. We're detecting drones on the back patio. Let them pass. I was hoping I still had the jetpack on or whatever that was, but you do not. No more sliding around. Multiple hostiles by the pole. Drop them. Oh, the guy actually hopped on the ground. That's so sick. Oh, shit. I'm going to tell you guys right now, if you've not seen that movie, Edge of Tomorrow, the start of this game, that's all that reminded me of. Everyone kind of using these extra suits to help them do different things they normally couldn't do, you know? That right there, I'm telling you, just it reminds me of that movie. And that's a fantastic film. Bitch! Oh, that's so sick. Wait, is this guy gonna... I don't know what that guy had. Go, go. Try to not do the uh, reloading way too much. I like that over-excessive thing. Here we go. What are we waiting for? Don't engage. Just let them pass. Oh, okay. Hang on. I hope I'm at a good spot. Yeah, I saw a picture. I think it was like a long time ago of some guy. That, some guy was like, uh, he shot one bullet in a light machine gun. He's <laughs> like, cover me, I'm reloading. He's got like a hundred shots left. Profit, we're approaching the north access road. What's our exfil status? Transport is coming in hot. ETA, one mic. We're gonna have to dig in until our ride gets here. Hold him off! What the hell's wrong? Come on, man! Atlas zero one, X Phil is on approach. Hop and smoke. There's our ride. Mitchell, get the president inside. Oh, that tracked him up there. I didn't even see them up there. Oh, let's go get in this thing. Are you shitting me? Sloppy, Mitchell. You're a dead man. Reset! No excuse for equipment failure. The best weapon you have is the one between your ears. Use it. Resetting simulation. Everyone return to your starting positions. It was his arm, sir. I knew it was too early. That arm's worth more to me than this entire facility. How's my boy doing? He's a work in progress. Well, keep working. This is a great soldier. It's a sad day indeed when the military has no use for good men like you. Jump in. 
I'll give you the tour. I must say, I oh, I thought, you know what? It's so weird that I, th I thought he was getting in that side. I was just trying to be ideal about it. Didn't know he's ho holding it open for me. They've definitely come a long way, though. I will say the Call of Duty series, you look back to, like, Modern Warfare... Call of Duty Modern Warfare for just Call of Duty 4, for instance. Campaign for that was unreal. Joker. We're bringing Mitchell over to R&D. Get the sim prep for another run. You got it, boss. What you're seeing is advanced warfare. Atlas has the single largest standing military in the world, but we answer to no country. Unlike the government, we don't keep secrets of our capabilities. We don't sell policy, we sell power. We are a superpower for hire. Power isn't just about the ability to destroy. Atlas has built infrastructures in places like Korea, Sierra Leone, Nigeria. We do in a few years what it takes governments decades to accomplish. In fact, the truth is, we're often more effective than the governments that hire us. So my son found out the hard way. That's so sick. This game plays amazing. It definitely is 60 frames a second, as far as I can tell. Mitchell. I know you're not in this for the money. You remind me a lot of Will in that way. Now go get that arm fixed. He seems like a cool guy, even in video games. Be funny if he's a bad guy or something at the end. Checkpoint reached. Yeah, I'm gonna try to make uh, each mission one video. I'm hoping I can do that at least. Irons has taken a shine to you. Don't let it go to your head. I don't know if you guys have ever tried rock climbing, but I definitely cannot do that. Going the whole like that that whole shit right? No, there's no way. No way, guys. A straight wall I can climb it, but that's about it. two types of exos. Assault and specialist. Each has a primary and secondary ability. Assault is equipped with boost jump, as well as sonics for crowd control. The specialist exo you're wearing has a built-in shield, in addition to overdrive capability. Technicians are waiting for you. Get that thing fixed up and meet me out here. Hello, Mitchell. Let's see what's going on with that arm. Please, step over here. Go ahead and place your arm on the table. Okay, just gonna run some diagnostics. Try and move your arm for me, please. Oh, that's so sick. Making a small adjustment. Hang on. Okay. Again, please. I think I see the problem. One more time, please. There we go. All right, you're good. But I recommend some trigger time to check the calibration. 